Yes, sir! What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Town, coming to you live with yet more ass waxery, live and direct from the place we like to respect and refer to as the Ass Factory. Y'all already know what time it is. Time for you to get off your damn belly! First blood, first blood. You're lucky if you get that first blood. I don't know how I didn't see that dude, man. But anyway, I was watching the sexual, th I mean, the Eight Thoughts video uh, yesterday, man. And, um... He said something pretty interesting, man. He was telling how uh, how Activision has... Uh, I'm going to put the video down in the description so you can get a better uh, idea of what's going on. But he said um, how Activision is, is pretty much giving us the dick again by uh, making you... Making you... Uh, pretty much when you buy Infinite Warfare, if you would like to continue to play... Well, everybody knows that when you get Infinite Warfare, you're going to get... Uh, if you buy the collector's edition or whatever fuck edition it is, I don't know the super the superhuman edition, whatever the fuck it is, you're going to get a copy of uh, Card Four. But uh, he said that Activision has made it so that uh, you you can't if you give Infinite Warfare back or if you turn it in, you can't play uh, Card Four anymore. Pretty much, I guess it's on the disc or or the disc has to be in. It's part of the the media launcher package or whatever the fuck it is. I don't know, man. You know how they used to do with Super Mario All Stars. Where they would give you Mario One, Two, and Three, or or you have you buy the extra game like on the Nintendo cartridge and it, and it was still in there. That's how it's gonna be, man. They're making it a package deal. I guess what they're probably gonna do is you're probably gonna have to go into Infinite Warfare and then it's gonna be a card for a section of of Infinite Warfare, which is not. Ooh, drop shot, drop shot. Give me them ankles in this motherfucker with the sign. Oh, backstabber, backstabber. Oh, OJ. Okay, uh, well, pretty much. Uh, you ain't gonna be able to turn your Infinite Warfare disc in, which is what everybody was gonna do. They know everybody under the motherfucking sun was gonna go buy themselves a copy of Infinite Warfare, the super duper bullshit edition, and when they bought it, they were gonna take that shit back and keep Card 4 if it was possible. And, uh, and maybe that's not even what they were thinking. I'm pretty sure it was, but, you know, giving them the benefit of the doubt, maybe they just put the launcher. Yeah, that's what the fuck they were thinking, because they could have made it two separate downloads. What they're gonna do is, like I said, they wanted people to buy Infinite Warfare, and, uh, and they want people to play that whack ass game, and uh, you know the only way to do it well, is is gonna be, is gonna be to uh, you know pr give give them something that they that you know they want, you know with something that you think they might want. So you know it's kind of like a um, you know it's less like like uh, strippers at the club. You know you want to go to the club, but you know you want to see you know you might want to go to the club, but you know you want to see some strippers or you know free head with every uh. Big Mac or some shit like that, you know what I'm saying? Like if you you you, you might want to you might want a Big Mac, but you know you want some free head. So hell, what, no matter how bad the uh the Big Mac is, right? The free head was worth it. That's kind of like what they do on a two for one, you know, give you some for free, and then uh and then uh you know give you force feed something down your throat. I don't know how many people actually gonna play Infinite Warfare. I'm sincerely hoping that it is not anything like. Uh, the other game, man, I just can't take, I, I mean, uh, what was the last game that they put out? That dumbass Advanced Warfare, that was the worst game, literally, I've ever played. I'm, I understand that they wanted to bring something different and use the boosting and the wall running and all that shit, but the thing is, you don't make a game where you can boost and wall run and get on top of things and then make it so that you can get on top of everything. I think, I, I hopefully, hopefully, who's that picking in the window? Pow! Nobody, nobody now. Two piece. Huh? Hopefully they realize that uh, the error of their ways and they take a take a a, a, a notch out of Treyarch's book or a page out of Treyarch's book and do it that way, where 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 you know everything still is tall. You can't just jump on top of everything and we're not shooting rooftop to rooftop. Look at this motherfucker laying down, man. I mean, he been laying down on this fucking belly ring the whole game. What the fuck, man? But anyway, um. You know, hopefully they'll do that. And I'm looking for this dude right here. I'm like, where the fuck is it? I guess the dude killed him. But good thing this dude right here didn't see me because I got his own guess his ass. Look, I mean, some people don't like boots on the ground. I like boots on the ground. Some people, I, I do like the movement, but I just don't like facing that dumb ass movement. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. Let me reload. Oh, I ain't got no bullet. OJ, uh, -huh. um, I, I just don't like facing it every time I'm in a damn gunfight, man. And what happened here was, uh, whoo, oh, oh, it's prime time. Let's get this shit started. PP7 number six. Gotta be extra smiling. This motherfucker if I ain't even smiling. Take back this stuff. Put on shelf, but I don't want it out. But uh, as you can see right here, man, the uh, chopper came in, started going stupid. I picked up this AK silence and then got that one piece, two piece. Uh, tell that bad boy in the corner to get from run, yeah, cause we're dangerous. Wow. And then the host migrated, man. Like I said, fantastic fucking game. Uh, my dog heart, they said it the best. We, you know, we clamor and 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 hope for a game. 
And then it's like, just like I told y'all, it's the nostalgia effect. These are the things that we forgot about the game. The game was fucking awful on so many levels. It's fun. It was a good game, but it was fucking awful on so many levels. And and, it, and like, this is just one of the things, man. You know, host migrated and, uh, you know, I lost the game. But anyway, man, go look at the 8 Thoughts video, man, because it's very informative. And, uh, you know, that's my dog. Being Ben been rolling for me. No, I know I'm being, you know, been making videos since the beginning. And, uh, you know, he's been fighting, still fighting a good fight. So, uh, hey, he, it looked like he done broke on through. Break on through to the other side. But if y'all, how many of y'all just saw this coming? That's what I want y'all to do. Put that down in the comments. How many of y'all saw some shit like this coming where they were going to try to, well, they knew that they had garnered enough um, interest. And so they were going to make it so that, uh, they're going to make it so that you couldn't get rid of the disc or whatever, man. But like I said, it's not unheard of. A lot of games have done it. They give you something free on the actual disc, and, and you still need a disc to play it. I mean, it's not unheard of. It ain't that bad, but um, it is some bullshit, though. It definitely is that. But anyway, I don't talk too long. I am out of here. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the motherfucking barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Holla! 360 out this motherfucker. You damn right I'm bringing the news. What I'm doing ain't working. I got to try some other shit. Man.